It's Vlogmas Day 3! The nail that felt like it was lifting broke. It fell off. So, I went searching in my drawers and I found this little bottle of nail glue, which I'm not sure was ever used. Ha ha, was never used. So I'm just gonna see if I can glue it back on. Ooh, I don't think I'll be able to glue it. That packet feels very stiff. It didn't work. <sighs> okay, it's just gone half past six. I'm due down in Berlin at seven and I'll redo this nail when I come home. That's the best. Okay, right now I'm going to open my advent calendar. It is time for day three of the Nespresso Virtual Advent Calendar. So let's open her up and see can we find day three. Ah, right down the bottom. So what's behind door number three? It's silver, okay. I realized yesterday when I was editing that I didn't do a great job at showing the actual uh, advent calendar. I might not have been as good today. We'll figure out a setup that works eventually. But we got the Grand Longo and it is A-R-O-N-D-I-O. Arundio? This is what it looks like. I have not had this one. Uh, it's 150 mil. Looking forward to trying it. Can't wait to finally get my Nespresso machine back. Still nothing. We're holding out hope. But doesn't this explain like uh, when I said that it was um, broken and I had to send it away and I was like, Oh, so disappointed, but I wanted to leave it a surprise that I had this advent calendar. It cost me 50 euros, um, which is a lot for an advent calendar, but I was really looking forward to it. I figured that it would be my month of coffee that I normally get. Oh, I'm so disappointed. Hi, I obviously am not just home from Brewery Lane because I had myself a shower, but um, I feel really refreshed. Just sometimes, you know, you just need a good shower. I need to fix my nail. It really broke. Um, it broke just as I was going out the front door and now it's really bad in need of a fix. So I'll probably do that in a little while but I'm gonna let my hair dry a little bit first and then I'll dry it with my shark and then I'll do my nail. It's almost 10 o'clock so I'm hoping that my hair will be dry by 11 and then at 11 I'll do my nail. But first I need to do my Kinder Bueno advent calendar. So we're looking for three, three. Three, three, what's this? The shine is on. Oh, that's ten. Oh, look at three right here. I wonder what it is. Oh my god, this is so exciting. <gasps> it's a white chocolate Kinder Bueno. Woo, 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 woo. After work today, I went to Hashtag Super Value because they had no turkey mints on Saturday. So I said I'd get some today. Spoiler alert, they didn't have any today either. So I just got regular mints. But anyway, I saw these Kehoe's crisps while I was there. Now, I'm not the biggest fan of Kehoe's crisps. But uh, I'm happy to try an interesting flavor. They are roast turkey and secret stuffing. Secret stuffing. What secret stuffing? I was just about to open them and they have this little thing on the top and it's a, like a tag and it says to and from. So these are to Sarah, from Sarah. Okay. Definitely smell herbs. So the, the secret to the stuffing is that it's very herby. Okay. These are delicious. Oh my God, I really like them. They're quite herby. So if you don't like herbs, then they're not gonna be for you. But they have this other flavor. It must be the turkey. And it's just, oh, they're really nice. They would be lovely in a crisp sandwich. Okay, it's St. Stephen's Day. And you've got leftover turkey and leftover ham. And you're gonna make a sandwich, but you want a little crunch. This is what you're putting in it. You're gonna get them. Kehoe's, roast turkey, and secret stuffing. The secret is, the stuffing's delicious. Oh my God. Oh my God. I've had a good few of these different turkey flavored crisps over the years, and it's very difficult for companies to get the balance between the stuffing and the turkey correct. But these, these got the balance. Now it's time to enjoy a few more of these crisps. I could very easily eat the bag. I'm gonna watch 
Hot Frosty on Netflix. It's supposed to be terrible. I can't wait. It's 11.06. I dry my hair and then I tidied it up and then I tidied up a little bit. So I was finished by, I think, like three minutes past 11. I am just fixing another couple of nails. So obviously one nail fell off, but there were some other ones where like some of the cat designs. Speaking of cats, Eileen's banging at the door. Anyhow, some of the, uh, like the tail of the cat and stuff had come off. So I just got some black gel and a little fine brush and I fixed it. So this is the nail I put a new nail on. I put one of the cat designs and this one I just used. It's not the best shape. And a little bit of this corner had come off and then this one too. I just also finished um, Hot Frosty. It's so cheesy, I love it. It's so bad, it's, it's good. Um, some of my personal favorite moments were when Lacey Sherbert, is that how you say her name? Her character uh, turns on the television and that Lindsay Lohan film where Falling for Christmas, that one came out last year, is on and she looks at it and goes, that girl kind of looks like a girl I went to high school with. And of course they were both in Mean Girls together. That's a very, very good reference. Also, the, the, the set. Anyone that's seen it and also knows it's a wonderful life, is that Bedford Falls? Like, to me it looked like Bedford Falls. Maybe it's just generic Christmas town set, but I was waiting for George Bailey to run down the street going, Hello, movie house! Can I say? That was my expectation. Another thing I really liked about uh, Hot Frosty was that Joe Tulio, I, I, I don't know how to say his name, Boyle from Brooklyn Nine-Nine, and Craig Robinson, who was also in Brooklyn Nine-Nine as Doug Judy, were both in this playing cops and they were just hilarious they're a really good duo and now i'm going to tidy up but before i tidy up i need to end this vlog because it's almost midnight well that is it for me thank you very much for watching if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up maybe share it subscribe if you want to see more of my face and if you want to follow me on any of my socials my details are in the doobly doo down below please enjoy another outro that i made we're gonna pick which one is the best so here's a new one see you tomorrow